So this sibling hates you so much that they're going to spread the narrative that because your parent, whether it be mother or father or grandmother, has a terminal illness that they are suffering with, they're going to flip it and say, oh, they got that because of you. They got that because of stress you caused them. You know how crazy siblings can be. So just be aware of this sibling who's going to try to blame your parents' terminal illness on you. Or your parent could have had the terminal illness and let's say they had cancer and they went to the chemo and now they're in remission. They're going to still say that was because of you. That was because of stress you caused them. When that doesn't even add up. The math ain't mathing. So this sibling is going to try to use that even if the, the mother or father or grandmother passes away. They're going to say, this one caused it, she caused it, he caused it. Or say, you're over there doing black magic, you did this to her, you did this to him, you did this to grandma, you did this to grandpa, you did this to mom, you did this to dad. That's what they're going to say. But you know your heart, you know what you do, you know what you don't do, and you don't dabble in the black magic, and the dark magic, and the, the dark arts. But they're going to try to say that when this person passes away, or even now they might be saying that. You, you see what they be doing over there. You see what they into. They don't even believe in God. They believe in... Who, and that's the thing, too. Why do they always think spiritual people don't believe in God? Yeah, but this sibling, this is all the ammunition, ammunition they needed. Sorry. This is all the ammunition they needed to further the narrative that is spread about you already. So let's say your father passes away, God forbid, or your mother passes away, God forbid. You know what I'm saying? They're going to say, you caused it. They're going to say, you did a spell. You did this. You did that. Or your behavior caused them to be so stressed that they got cancer. They got a brain tumor. They got multiple cirrhosis or whatever they got. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> whatever they are, you know, onset diabetes or, you know, stuff like that. They're going to blame it on you. As crazy as that might sound, they're going to blame it on you. This crazy-ass sibling who got nothing else better to do is going to blame it on you. Now, on another note, this sibling could be suffering too because they did the same thing the mother or father did to you or the grandfather or grandmother did to you. They did the same exact thing, but maybe on a lower level. Like maybe they weren't going to a practitioner to put spells on you, but they were doing just as bad, spreading gossip, spreading slander to your high school friends, your, your old neighborhood friends, your, your old other cousins, other family members. They were spreading slander at the puppet hands of your mother or father or a grandmother or grandfather. So they all in the same misery boat.